Dutch Fair behind me is perhaps one of the most impressive paintings in the collection at Time and Tide Museum. It's enormous and it's even more striking because of the way that it hangs on this bare brick wall of what was the salt store in the original factory. This particular painting is one that's always caught my eye because there's so much going on in it. Every time you walk past and stop to take a look, you see something new that you hadn't seen before. It was painted by George Vincent in 1821 and depicts the annual herring fair that took place in Great Yarmouth. This tradition began in medieval times and took place from Michaelmas, 29th of September, to Martinmas, the 11th of November. You can just imagine the sounds of the hustle and bustle going on as the town's population swelled with Dutch visitors. For me, it's the sounds of this picture that I always imagine when I look in. The call of the market traders, the clinking of the ship's rigging and the sounds of the sea, the chatter, the drunken singing, the music and the dancing. And above all of that, Britannia looks down from the top of Nelson's monument, watching over events. At the time this picture was painted, the monument had only been in place for two years. And now she's been standing up there for 202 years. If you could ask her, what do you think she'd say about the things she's seen? How Yarmouth has changed in that time.